Saturday, the 12th of June, I think. And I'm on. It's the first day of the Dream Festival. And, um, they want your bands here. They got up early this morning. It was so hard to get off bed because it's so cold. Um, we had the alternative. Hold on. Don't let me interrupt your child, man. Good day, I'm Derek. How are you, man? What's your name again, bro? I just forgot. Stevie. Stevie. Stevie's my name. Nice. I'm Jeff, anyway. I'm, I'm, the, Jeff. I'm the sound guy. Fantastic. But I, I play guitar. I'm a musician, but I like these guys. Since I saw these guys I'm play guitar, I gave up. All right. Yeah. I kind of squeezed this trip in last minute. My friend Janet Panic asked me just to come and jam with her. And I was literally in Costa Rica last last week on tour with Aerosmith, so I just literally got done and came up here. All right. Golden bra. Aerosmith then gang. Aerosmith then gang. Yeah, oh, uh, sounds like you live a really hard life. Well, you know, I mean, it's not as sexy as it sounds. How's your um, guitar skills? I'm saying. I don't know how to describe it. If you took James Brown and Jimi Hendrix and had a baby, yeah. it's sort of always been my style. I just look for great songs, great artists, not so much great genres, you know what I mean? All right. like, I get too bored. If I just worked only on speed metal or worked only on hip hop, I would want to kill myself. It's like I need to get a blend of music on overall. Sounds you like me. Too? I mean, I suck at the bass. No, but I, get, I, mean, I play with guys like Bootsy Collins and those guys, and when you play with them, it's like you don't want to pick up the bass anymore. So. Mostly guitar is my instrument. This is the time to move. drive for a gig if you're not going to play in your community? Uh, like six hours to so Alice Springs. Every, so every gig is a massive commitment, right? Yeah. Dollar-wise, too, just for the petrol, right? Yep. What kind of strings are you using? Strings. Jimmy Dunlop's like my brother. In case you want to get your is metal he? on, I got, yeah, literally, some big right. engagement. In case you got to tune down and get all heavy in the studio. Then that's cool, because that's the Indian, that's the Indian <laughs> superhero right there. In case you forget your name, right? I mean, and the guy's voice is amazing. I mean, Jeremy's, when Jeremy started singing it, it sounded like, like Buddy Miles in 1971 or something. He's got that. It's here's a really odd thing for me being an American. You can see the black art form of, of rhythm and blues and rock and roll, no matter if it's people from Africa, people from America, people from deep in the desert of Australia. That 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 still that soul comes through, no matter no matter what. I mean, 
if, if you just looked at him and you go, God, this could have been, you know, some black guys jamming down in New Orleans right now with the Neville Brothers or something. I mean, it's still got that natural thing that's in the DNA that no matter where you're from, that they got that soul. I mean, they had that, that flavor, man. It's fantastic. How do you make the million dollars in the music industry? Start with two. <laughs> <laughs>